Oh my god, do you know what time it is? It's time for a new VLOG! How the fuck are you guys doing today? I'm doing alright. Just, you know, kinda late and shit like that. Uh, as you guys can see behind me on the bung board, Nothing has changed, because I'm actually just logging on to RuneScape right now. And, uh, my shit actually sold. So, <laughs> yay! You know, my shit is selling the G and stuff like that. I know yesterday I said that none of my shit was, uh, selling the G, but, you know, today my herbs, or, uh, herb seeds actually sold. So, I'm really kind of happy. But, so I can farm. Probably, though, not going to be, you know, I'm not going to be 91 farming uh, by tonight, but probably tomorrow evening or, you know, sometime. But just a reminder, guys, uh, I might do a live show tomorrow. I may not. Depends what time I actually get on. Um, because normally, you know, like I've been doing live shows kind of late and stuff and like around uh, like 7.30, 8.00. Would really want, you know, I really want to do one in the afternoon, but just, you know, la like last Sunday I was busy and shit, um, and th uh, th tomorrow I'll be busy, so, uh, you know, it kind of sucks, but oh well. But there's always the next week. <laughs> That's the good thing about weeks. They never stop coming. But anyways, let me see. What other shit do I have to blog about? Uh, whoop, uh, ah, Yes. I kind of want to talk something. Kind of want to talk about something today that I haven't talked about in a while. And I actually, you know, like uh, I got a message from one of you guys last week, and um, uh, you know, I I kind of want to talk about it, like you know, a couple of days ago, but kind of just spaced out and forgot about it. But I want to talk about merchandise. Oh yes, and if you would like me to talk about something, make sure you leave your RuneScape name because a lot of you know messages that I get, people don't send me RuneScape names, so I can't really give them a shout out. Oh well. But anyways, this person asked me, "What do I think? Like, would it be like is it a good time for them to like buy items and you know solo merch? And you know, like I said this many times." Stay away from clans, stay away from large groups. You can make tons and tons of money on your own, like I have. I've made probably well over 500 mil in the past flipping god swords. Just, you know, buying a god sword one day and then turning around and selling it a little higher the other day. Now, of course, when I used to do that, there was... Well, okay, when I did that shit, like over a year and a half ago, god swords weren't dry... You know, they don't... Back then, they were kind of stable. And what I mean by that is, like, uh, you would go on the forum... Or not the forums, the GE, you know, on the RuneScape site. And on there, you would see that maybe one day they dropped by 50k. The next day, they rose by 50k. Maybe they would drop by, like, 80k. But you don't see... Nowadays, you see them dropping by, like, 350k, 500k, 750k, some 1.1 mil... Uh, then they rise up by 1.1 mil. You really want to stay away from items like, you know, those. Now, merchanting and investing is different. Like, for example, I have a friend who has 11 fucking Santas. That is called investing because he's investing his money, and he bought a ton of them when they were, like, 14 mil, some at 21 mil, some at, like, 50 mil. And now they're, what, 101 mil? So, you see, you guys see what I'm saying? That's investing. But I would, you know, flip-flop, you know, take items and turn, you know, just sell them for hire and stuff like that. But right now, like, a lot of the items, and even if you have, like, you can't really be good at this unless you actually have, like, at least 50 mil. Um, reason being is because at one point I had 188 mil, and then I was like, okay, I got, you know, kind of tired of merchanting. And mainly because I had all the items I really wanted. You know, I had all the items in my dream list. So I'm like, okay, you know, fuck it. I really don't need to do it anymore. But I had 188 mil cash. And some days I would buy, like, um, back then the Armadale God Swords were a lot cheaper. So some days I would buy two Armadale God Swords and Bandos God Swords. Some days I would buy maybe, like, four Bandos God Swords. Um, 
but I tried staying away from putting all my money in one item. Because, like, for example, I had three Sarah God Swords once, and I was not on for the entire weekend. And I came back on on Monday, and yeah, guess what happened? They went down, and I ended up losing about 1.5 mil. I lost about 500k per God Sword. So, it, you know, just was terrible. And it sucked balls! Because I was like, wow, you know, but some days I actually made a lot. Like, some days I ended up making, like, four mil a day. Or well, every, like, you know, maybe day and a half, four mil every day and a half, but still. The question was, do I think that, you know, marketing is really good right now? Probably not for God Swords, because, like I said, they're just really unstable. And if you get something and it crashes just out of the blue, then the best thing is you don't go ape shit and sell it, like some people would. You keep it, and you have to wait for like two weeks, maybe even three weeks before the item starts going back up in price. And then you sell it, and you can maybe make like 100k, which is terrible for three weeks, but oh well. I don't really suggest doing merch thing right now, mainly because the GE is really unstable. Um, a lot of my friends, or some of my friends are actually doing uh, like merch thing by doing other items than like the big ones and stuff like that. Um, probably, like, alright, like, a few of my friends, they merchant other type of items rather than guy. Like, they merchant low-cost items. They buy a lot of low-cost items, and then they sell them for a little bit above, you know, uh, the GE. And, you know, it's, it's not clan merch thing, it's just they buy, it's kind of like what I did with Pure Essence. I would buy them, you know, right below the GE price, or rather back then there was no fucking GE price. But buy them for near lowest of what they, you know, went for, and then I would sell them near highest, and I made a lot of money. Too bad it's not like the old RuneScape. Oh, tiddly shit. But guys, that's really all I got to blog about today. I hope that helps some of you guys out. If you had some questions about should I, you know, be merchanting God Swords or whatever, you know, it's really, it's really up to you. If you want to take the risk, but me personally, I don't really need, need to make a lot of money on RuneScape because I have a lot of the items that I really want. Skilling, it brings in enough moolah for me. But anyways, uh, probably not going to be on RuneScape that much. Just want to do a farming run right now. You know, maybe play like one or two games of Stealing Creations. Uh, possibly. But I want to go my email address right now. Ask9mrhyahoo.com. Do not drink too many yous, otherwise we get fucked up. Disclaimer 101. First, Hoover Hoover question. Hey, what's up, Knight? I have some questions for you. RS username, Mr. Killing Dude. Do you like the band Ramstein? Why don't you ever... Question two. Why don't you ever make PvP videos in Ar Ardungween... Ween, or whatever the fuck that town is called? Question three. Do you think agility will be a pain in the balls? Uh, first one, do I like the band uh, Ramstein? I like a few songs by them, uh, although I don't own any of their albums, but I do uh, like a couple songs by them. Why don't I ever make PvP videos in that fucked up naming town? I don't have an Ar Ar Arweenie teleport. Um, I haven't done the fucking Plague City or, or whatever the quest is called to get the teleport access. So that's why I don't go there. It's because I don't have a teleport to there. If I could teleport there, then yes, I would make videos there. Uh, do I think agility will be a pain in my balls? Fuck yeah, I do, okay? I did 400,000 experience and almost wanted to neuter myself. I uh, know. I will never do that, but still, okay? <laughs> it sucks. Trust me. And if you guys have 99 agility out there, then you can agree that agility sucks. Next question. What would you do if you accidentally leveled a combatable skill and you got 116 combat? Um, I made a video about this. I'm actually fairly close to uh, 87, uh, like, I think like 49,000 experience till 87 hit points. And 64,000 experience till uh, 81 strength. Um, yeah, I, in last year, I was like over 100k away from the next hit points level. Um... It's going down slowly whenever I do PvP videos or whenever I do shit like that. I probably will in the, you know, future, 
But what will I do? Like I said before, probably just... Yeah, I'll be pissed, but... Oh, tiddly shit. You know, it's something that I can't change. And 116... You know, 116 combat is actually an even number, rather than 115. But I have grown to like the number 115. So, oh well. But anyways, guys, if you got anything for me, leave me a nasty, dear little comment. Otherwise, I will see you motherfuckers tomorrow. Enjoy your night, guys. Bye.